Hey everyone, um, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to get to your factory subwoofer. Um, first of all, first thing you do, you need to take this off. You need to take this out, take that piece out, and I'll do that right now. I'm going to give my phone to my cameraman. So, it's really simple. Bring up the tabs. I'm sure you have probably done this already if you have one of these. Okay, now what you want to do, bring this up, take it out. This part right here just has little tabs. It just pops out. Okay, um, oh yeah, also take this out, be very careful, this just pops out too, yep, that's why you're very careful, because you might lose those little tabs that go right here, so put that aside without losing those tabs, alright, so now go to your passenger, rear seat and you want to get a 10 millimeter socket um, you want to lift oh, your back seat up kind of angle it down this part right here be very gentle but this just uh, pops out just like that those little clips Okay, there's going to be a bolt right here, and that's to take this piece off. Nope, that's the right way. Alright, just put that bolt aside, don't lose it. Alright, so... Then go ahead and bring your back seat down all the way. And now I'm going to have the cameraman sit right over here and I'll show you, well, or angle. I'm going to, I'm going to have him go ahead and pause it so he can get in position of where he needs to be in order to watch the rest of us. All right, guys. So the next step you want to do Take your seatbelt out. And this is going to be kind of tricky because there's a rubber piece that's keeping this secured in there. But if you kind of pull up and wiggle, ugh, there you go. So that's what's in it. Take out that, I guess it's a rubbery plastic. Yeah, come on. It'll lift right out. But once you get that out, Put it back on because it's so much easier to putting this back on with that piece already attached to it. So we'll put that aside. Okay. Okay, so now the next thing you want to do is you'll have two of these little plastic tabs, one right here, and then another one's going to be down here. I've already taken mine out. And then you want to get a small flathead screwdriver is you want to pop open this tab just like that and you'll have a screw right there you also have the same thing right here just do what I did over here I'm not going to do it right here because mine stripped out so I actually dremeled around it so it's not even attached to it anyways um, next thing do is pop this there's going to be a 10 millimeter bolt right here. Looks just like that. So I want to undo the bolt.
Okay, I'm gonna get my screwdriver. Okay, then I'll, like I said, unscrew this part. Again, I don't have to. Okay, so the next step is, again, if you don't have this tool, please get one. It's gonna help out. But um, you need to get this tool. Pop your tab, and if you break it, you break it. Just buy some more. Um, so you got that one and the other one over here. Now what you want to do is take off the molding, mostly on this gray piece. Because that's the part that you're really taking off right there. And then take the molding off right here. Okay. So now what's going to do is mainly what you're going to do is you're just going to unclip it from this light gray area. slow all right this is the part that I was having issues with last time now if you want to you can take this whole assembly off but you really don't need to there we go okay now it's all loose. Just now you move this, that. And now we should be able to see the sub. I've already taken mine out. Um, but that's how you get to your subwoofer. Uh, any questions? Need any help with something maybe you didn't understand? Let me know and I'll do my best to help you. Thanks for watching.